So I think that uh, the next big step in RPA is how do we get products uh, into the hands of our operations folks faster? Uh, and I think the only way we're gonna be able to do things like that is to democratize RPA um, using things like UiPath Go and other things like that, I think are a fantastic way to be able to speed up the uh, introduction of RPA into the operational processes that we need to that we need to automate. It's definitely the reusability aspect is probably most important, right? Um, when we are building automated processes for common business things, finance and accounting, HR, master data management, those types of things, uh, it's it it makes sense to be able to have something that we can library thing for use of reusability because those processes, even though in different companies. Uh, they are all relatively the same. And so there's a ton of reusability in that space. And so having something where clients and, uh, and developers can go to a library and get content out uh, to help um, speed up their development, uh, I think is fantastic. Um, the other important thing is I think we need to upskill our people, right? And so that's really important to me. I think it's really important to our clients is that uh, it's not just about developers anymore. It's about taking these operational folks who have the true subject matter expert knowledge that have been doing this job for five, six years. Uh, it's really important that they have a seat at this table when it comes to RPA. And so anything we can do to speed up how these folks become upskilled uh, is also a, a huge benefit for us. And you know, having reusability libraries and, and, and educational programs and all of those types of things I think are really important to the industry. RPA is a maturity level now where we really shouldn't be looking at little pieces of the process. We need to look at the process from end to end and try to automate all of it, right? So go in and basically say, you know, what can't we automate in this process, not what we can automate in this process. And I think that's the big difference. So I, I still see the industry is still thinking about automation as a solution for little pieces of the process and not seeing the big picture of why don't we take an entire invoice processing from the piece of paper all the way through to an entry into SAP or something like that? Instead of trying to automate little pieces of it, look at the whole thing. And so I think that's 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 really what we need to do in the next the, to really take it to the next level for our clients. I think again, stability of the product is fantastic, and so that's really helpful to us uh, to build client confidence. Um, the products like UiPath Go, as we talked about. Uh, is really on point in getting us to be able to be uh, faster and more agile at delivering things to our client. Uh, the more reusability that we can have, the better. Uh, I love the fact that you're going down uh, the path of like Studio X and things like that and really trying to bring operational people that may not have a lot of technology background, um, allow them to be able to work with the product and be successful in building their own robots. Uh, so that's really exciting. So yeah, I think the, the roadmap is, uh, is in really good shape for us.